हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स आई एम शुभेंदु सर माय यूट्यूब चैनल इज मैथो प्लाजा नाउ आई इंट्रोड्यूस ए न्यू चैप्टर ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स दैट इज कॉल्ड अ नंबर सिस्टम एट फर्स्ट वी हैव टू नो दैट व्हाट इज नंबर सिस्टम नंबर सिस्टम इज ए सिस्टम कंसिस्टिंग ऑफ वेरियस टाइप ऑफ नंबर नंबर सिस्टम इज ए ब्रांच ऑफ प्योर मैथमेटिक्स मैथमेटिक्स इज द क्वीन ऑफ साइंस ऑलरेडी वी हैव नोन नाउ वी हैव टू नोन नंबर सिस्टम इज वन ऑफ द ग्रेटेस्ट टॉपिक इन मैथमेटिक्स एंड ऑल्सो नंबर सिस्टम इज द क्वीन ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स हाउ वी विल ट्रीट नंबर सिस्टम नंबर सिस्टम ट्रीट्स फैक्टराइजिंग एंड डिविजिबिलिटी दैट इज फैक्टरिंग एंड डिविजिबिलिटी ऑन द नंबर एट फर्स्ट वी हैव टू स्टडी व्हाट इज रियल नंबर रियल नंबर कंसिस्ट ऑफ टू कैटेगरीज ऑफ नंबर एट फर्स्ट रेशनल नंबर एंड इज रेशनल नंबर नाउ वी हैव टू find how to check which number is rational numbers and also which number is irrational numbers a number which can be expressed of the form p by q q not equal to 0 p and q are integers as for example the rational numbers can be written as p by q example one by one two by one three by one four by one it is we have to must follow the denominator not equal to 0 that means q not equal to 0 it is the must condition for rational numbers next we have to identification tricks how we will choose rational numbers number 1 tricks terminating that means rational numbers are terminating example 5.63 and 6.73 these numbers are terminating that means after decimal point two numbers are there number 2 non terminating or repeating or recurring example 1.121212 3.3333 here two num two numbers after decimal 121212 are repeating here after decimal 333 are repeating that means non terminating that is called repeating that is called recurring next we will have to know real numbers numbers are two types number 1 integer number 2 fraction what is integers as if for example minus 5 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 0 1 2 3 etc that means integers are we have to show in a straight line 
we have to draw a graph. This is x-axis. This is y-axis. These two axes meet at the point that is called O. Here we have to write this is 0. Right side 1, 2, 3, 4, etc. In left side minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, etc. It will be end as minus infinity and right side it will be end as plus infinity. That means integers are belongs to category minus infinity to plus infinity. In this interval the integers are belongs. So integers can be divided in three parts or three category. 0 is the midpoint in the diagram. In the left side that is called negative integer. As for example minus infinity next minus 5, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1. That is in the diagram this is called bar or this area is called negative integer. Okay. Are you understanding? Okay. Follow. Till at the end. This is 0. 0 is here. At the right side from the 0 that is called positive integer. As for example, the positive integer start from 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc. That means positive integer 1, 2, 3, 4, that's we have counted. This is called positive integer or counting numbers. Which numbers we have counted? 1, 2, 3, 4, etc. Or it is called natural numbers so positive integer or counting number or natural numbers are same next zero and positive integer together we have called whole number that means whole numbers are belongs to category start from 0 and positive integer start from 1 so 0 1 2 3 4 5 etc this is called whole number next part integers one category and second category is called fraction example 1 upon 2 1 upon 3 1 upon 5 etc Okay, next we will to introduce irrational numbers. What is irrational number? A number that cannot be expressed as P by Q. As for example, root 2, root 3, root 5, etc. That means non perfect square term. So, root 4 equal to 2 root 4 is rational or irrational what will be the answer this is clear this is root 4 is perfect square that is root 4 equal to 2 this is perfect square so root 4 is not a rational number this is called rational number Okay, so root 4, summon 2, root 4 is perfect square, so root 4 is not irrational number, root 4 equal to 2, this is called rational number. Now we have two tricks, identification tricks, how we will identify, how we will identify the irrational number. 
Tick one, non terminating. Example one point zero one zero zero one zero 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 one. That means the numbers after decimal non terminating. Number two, non repeating. After decimal, the numbers are not repeating. That means different digit appears after decimal point. Okay, so that's why rational plus irrational number is called real numbers. Real numbers divided into two categories: rational numbers and irrational number. Rational numbers are categorized in two parts: integers or fraction. Integers and fraction. Integers are divided into three parts: negative integer, zero, and positive integer. Now we have to know application of number systems. How are we apply number system? Very much important in mathematics, computer science, physics, every area. We have to use number system. Number system uses in number one computer arithmetic. Number two. Number system uses in numerical integration. Number three, number system uses in error connecting ports. So number system will be applied in three areas. Number one, computer arithmetic. Number two, numerical integration. Number three, error connecting codes. So next video, we have to define or we have to introduce or beta tricks the various type of numbers. Number one. Prime numbers, number two, co prime numbers, number three, composite numbers, number four, even numbers, number five, odd numbers, number six, complex numbers, number seven, imaginary numbers. So these numbers are studied in the next video. Thank you.